Hello everyone and welcome to the vlog. Uh, this is Monday. This is Monday. I just finished filming the video about subscription box, upgrade that subscription box and I decided to film like a vlog for this week because I'm preparing for the store update which um, I don't know when the video will be up but probably at this point the store update is already happening so that's exciting. I guess the first most exciting thing is I am going to print t-shirts. Um, yay! <laughs> I guess I need to share this first. They're not printed now so I have like a few days to print them and um, I, I mean like I still have time so but yeah this is like one of the colors and uh, it's like this uh, sage green color and I love this color so much and um, the other one is uh, like raw white which is like this natural white with some speckles and um, I really like that one as well. Also I decided in last minute that I will be designing more stickers. Um, I decided it yesterday when I was um, near, the, near the sea with my husband and I was just sketching in my sketchbook and it kind of clicked that I need to make more stickers. So basically I was going to have two new sticker designs. Um, probably you have heard about these, I talked about them before. But one was like sheepy, one was like a fox. And I thought like I will have two new sticker designs each st store update uh, from now on. But uh, yeah, I decided to sketch out uh, all the sticker designs and send the file tomorrow. And I know that it takes usually like up to two weeks to send the stickers um, back to me. So the store update is this Friday. So I, I will probably not get them by this time, but I decided to maybe put like some pre-order or maybe I could add them that they are in the store, but the waiting time is a little bit longer. But I want to show you the stickers. So sketched in, on like some loose papers and do you remember I had like these um, snails uh, which said I'm slow artist and that's okay so I decided I could do it with um, seagulls now <laughs> seagull holding a brush stepping on top of canvas and it's like I'm slow artist and that's okay and there's also another design which is like kind of uh, I also love this one. So I will probably have like two stickers, both with seagulls being an artist. And I really like how this, how interesting this posture is. I will have more stickers and hopefully they will arrive and, um, at, at some point um, next week. I also have like two new lino prints coming up. So this was like the seagulls I printed in one of the recent videos. And I also have like these sheepies, which will be also in the store update. And yeah, as you can see, I have a lot of things already prepared. I just need to finish up some things. And I think I also need to think where I will print my screen prints because uh, for t-shirts it's better to have like a press, printing press, um, not like hinge claps. And I actually have press. I didn't told you, my Patreons know it like for a while now. But I have like super huge press, but I didn't thought it will be that huge. So when I got it but finally here, I was like, okay, how should like, where? <laughs> I was like speechless, I didn't know what to do. So it's like kind of, um, it's uh, in garage. So maybe I will print there, but maybe I can bring it for a day here and print on a porch and then put it back there. We'll see. Um, so the t-shirt design is fox um, with like leaves and it's kind of like autumn-y but not really, it can suit any season and um, I was thinking to do it in two, two colors so wish me luck with two colors maybe it will be disaster and I will have only one color, we'll see Okay, hello to this um, sketch This is the same day I recorded the intro and I'm just sketching the stickers ideas. I actually recently bought like a sample pack of different options, different sticker ideas and I think I would love to have like mirror stickers. This canvas could be like a mirror or something like that and this is another 
design and I will draw like canvas and I think it will be similar like this I'm slow artist and that's okay just more dynamic with open arms open wings this could work so this is also canvas one more sticker design and just see how it looks. Again, um, I just sketched some more stickers, uh, sticker ideas. I think I will go with these two, but I might do third one as well. We'll see. I think what I will do, I will scan them in and uh, just play in the computer. Also, I need to edit the video about upgrade art subscription box. I filmed it today, so maybe I will do that, but yeah. Okay, <laughs> anyways, see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, bye. decided to like uh, film a little bit how I edit the video and just so show you a little bit behind the process I realized I actually never showed behind the scenes how I edit the videos and maybe that's something you would love to see um, as you can see I have in the background a video I just edited it completely but sometimes I do like full checkup and I need to re-watch it or re-listen to it from from the beginning till the end so because it's already six in six afternoon i think it's afternoon um and i haven't started sketching the fox on top of the 
glossy paper, I decided to do two things at the same time. So I will basically listen in my headphones um, how I speak and if everything is cohesive and if there was like some uh, uh, too many of them, then I could like cut them. <laughs> um, um, yeah, so because I have them and uh, I guess that's natural. There are also some words I repeat all over again, again and again and again. So I'm cutting them as well. I also, I did one break in between editing and I decided to answer some comments. I really like reading your comments. So I finally answered to some of them. I will continue answering throughout this week till I, I answered them all. And also, maybe you saw like I had like piece of paper. Sometimes I write some ideas down and you're really good at suggesting some things for me to try or film. And if something is like interesting me, I'm just writing it down for the future. And I'm just kind of keeping all those notes in one place. And whenever I need inspiration or need to remember something or need to think what to film, I always can come back and do that. But yeah, thank you for commenting. Thank you so much. And now let's, um, yeah, I will use headphones. I will listen to the video and I think I will sketch the fox, not on the main paper, but just on the sketchbook and then on the main paper, something like that. And um, yeah, if you're wondering, this is how the full clip looks. <laughs> I am using DaVinci Resolve. This is how many clips I have. So I think I counted it was like, um, I have 148 clips in this video clip and this is uh, less than 35 minutes. So yeah, kind of exciting. I will also check some colors. I sometimes miss them, but usually I am checking the colors. So it's not too light or too, too dark and there's like some kind of harmony in between the slides. So yeah, okay, uh, I'm gonna just continue doing that <laughs> and see you later. <coughs> okay, hello everyone, hello back to this vlog. Um, today is Thursday, I actually didn't record yesterday whatsoever. Um, I guess yesterday was kind of my day off. I went to the sea and uh, spent some time with my husband and I don't know where the full day went but here I am and this is Thursday. I have allergy, um, I am sneezing and my eyes are itchy and my nose is itchy and I think I have hay fever and what better place to live than in summer house surrounded by the fields, <laughs> right? <laughs> um, yeah, I'm... I'm not feeling so good uh, because of hay fever, but oh well, it is what it is. Um, I hope the hay fever will slow down. Maybe I will Google and search for some pills or maybe I will visit doctor. We'll see how bad this will all be. But yeah, so today, Thursday, this is the day I'm exposing and printing the t-shirts. So yesterday when I was at the beach, I actually took some product pictures for the store update, which is really exciting. I will edit them today at some point. I also ordered t-shirt, screen printed t-shirt from Jess was here. Uh, she is my friend and um, really nice person. And she also has YouTube channel and she also does screen pr printed t-shirts. So check her out. Um, look how beautiful. Um, so the, there is like raccoons dancing and it says no overthinking zone. So this is what I need today. So that's why I'm wearing it. And also it's super hot. So it's perfect. T-shirts are perfect. Currently I am um, finishing up the fox design. Um, this is one color. So this is how it looks. Um, I don't know if I told you, but I'm going to print T-shirts in two colors which might be kind of ambitious. We'll see how bad everything will be. I will show you the second design. So that one was first. So this is like the first color. And this is the second one. And the second one is like more like line work. And this is more like a color. So yeah, <laughs> something like that. I am also, I need to write some codes to the Patreon, by the way, if you ever wanted to join the Patreon, 
um, this is good time because the beginning of the month you have access to new stuff throughout the month and you can also see the previous posts in previous months and also I am doing like discount codes uh, over there so if you want to get some discounted things from my store update you can uh, join the cozy fireplace there to get 10% off and you can join uh, a page from a book tier which is higher tier 15% off so yeah <laughs> what better way to get discounts than join the patreon um, I had to put this in <laughs> so. and I'm going to probably expose the screen off camera because uh, I'm uh, there is no dark place in this place so I'm going to garage and yeah kind of do it over there but i will return at some point and i will print t-shirts hopefully today and tomorrow i will take pictures and just publish everything uh, i think my plan is to expose it and print the designs today but also meanwhile put all the product pictures for other items i am going to sell on my etsy and tomorrow it's Friday, so it's like the store update day, and I will just take product pictures of t-shirts and then put them in and that's it. And I will not do anything else. I will meet up with Melanie Chadwick and just meet up with people. Kara Mist from Cornwall, so that will be super exciting. I, I want to have like some time off a little bit and I actually took some time off in between this week and last week and I feel so much better I think I was like slowly burning out because I had so many things to do and I said yes to so many th things and I just needed to have rest <laughs> and maybe you notice it in some of my videos that I was like super tired or stressful or all over the place rest is the best answer to everything so yeah I feel so much better okay let's um uh, Let's do some more um, design work and yeah. <laughs> I just finished making the t-shirt design I am preparing to expose the screen I'm going to do it after half hour um, currently I decided to use cardboard and color it completely black because I need it for ex exposing the screen I have hay fever and I feel I will sneeze and cough at any moment I don't know it's really bad today maybe because it's like sun without clouds and all the pollen is like <laughs> so close oh, this is so awful because it's hot but I I just closed almost all of the windows here and it's hard to breathe but at the same time I feel if I will leave the door open I will I will be sick so I don't know I hope this will pass but unfortunately I'm not sure about that so I will possibly read a little bit more about hay fever because I never in my life had hay fever until last year and I 
uh, at first I thought it's because of vaccine, because I got the hay fever just right after the vaccine. And, uh, but I learned also that last year was like really high for the hay fever and a lot, lot of people got it who didn't have it before. And I never in my life had it before. So yeah, now this is apparently the thing now because this is my second year and I have hay fever. Uh, my eyes are itchy. My nose is itchy. I want to sneeze. I want to cough. Um, I don't know. This is awful. I, I'm probably red, super red now. But yeah, this is just how I feel now. Okay, I will continue on. I will cut it out and color it completely black. And then I will prepare everything and go to expose the screen. So yeah, okay, <laughs> see you in a bit. Beat step over splinters of the moon. of June. Um, it's Saturday and this is one day after the store update just happened. Just. <laughs> so I didn't film a lot in the studio yesterday, but basically um, hay fever confirmed. I have really strong reaction. I don't feel so good, but uh, I cannot avoid the hay fever because I'm literally living by the field. And even though now I am really conscious when I open the door, I still need to go out because um, I need to go to the kitchen, which is in different area. The shower is in different area. Even toilet is in different area. So yeah, <laughs> that's, uh, I guess, not super good news. I also, I didn't finish everything for the store update. I was thinking I will print the t-shirts on Friday. Um, but everything happened so fast and I was still being like super sensitive with uh, hay fever and I also had like a meeting with uh, Mel and Pippa in, in here in Cornwall and I just decided in the last m minute to do pre-order for my store update so basically if any of you is buying t-shirt it will be ready in like two weeks time and then I will send it out it will not be so much pressure on me because then I can like do it slowly and carefully and print them nicely. And that's what I'm going to do. I I visited uh, Pippa studio yesterday, so I'm going to insert some beautiful clips from there. I did like a coaster drawing with Melanie Chadwick and it was during the open studios. And I actually didn't know what is open studios, but it's happening every year in Cornwall and you can visit different places, different artists and I just felt it's so such a nice idea and I will try to visit more studios in the future. Hello! <laughs> My name is Pippa. Yay! And this is her studio, beautiful studio.
Ježíši. <laughs> This is well. Nothing is awkward. Everything is super nice. <laughs> We are drawing coasters. Going to draw. Oh, going to draw. There's nothing. Yeah, it's to actually <laughs> just started. So as you can see, it's just like one blank piece of, not paper, but ceramic piece. <laughs> ceramic. Yeah. <laughs> I waited here but nothing came So I Today my plan is like to print first layer of t-shirts and um, everything is like ready. I exposed the screen I think on Thursday. It's already set up with hinge clubs. I destroyed my table which was quite sad because whenever you need to use the hinge clubs you need to attach it to the table and screw it so it's kind of not so good anymore. I also pre-mixed um, kind of like my rusty orange tone for the fox. I used um, this um, Permacet Aqua um, ink which I bought recently and I also had like turquoise the same brand and I decided to add like um, a lot of this orange and like a bit of turquoise to make the color a little bit duller and the the mix I made it's looking like like that it's quite a beautiful tone and I'm gonna print with it the first layer uh, we'll see if it's light or dark is it alright or not okay and also I want to say thank you so much to Heather, Nicole, Christina, Linda and Melanie for buying my newest store um, products I'm so so happy I'm like really pumped and excited to print it's already like towards the end of the day which um, I guess I took some time off because I really needed to have some rest and only now I decided okay I will print first layer. I also just made an order from Echocraft uh, website. So Echocraft website is like uh, it sells uh, packaging materials which are self-sustainable and which are either recyclable or made of paper or from compost materials and I used that website before and I actually bought like those transparent bags where I put some stickers in sometimes or like zines or A6 prints but uh, I read that uh, the best packaging thing is glassine bags and uh, I kind of went and bought some glassine bags which will be in like A6 size and I also bought uh, large letter postal mailers and those are made from just recycled materials so I just want to be like more conscious what I'm buying and what I will sell and people will receive and I encourage everyone who, who buys something from me to reuse the packaging again. I also use reuse the packaging as well. These t-shirts which I'm printing right now they are organic and also unisex so they could fit either like any gender or non-gender. And also, I know that I don't have a lot of sizes now, but I hope in the future I will add more because I want to uh, like present diversity and uh, it's just, I don't have a lot of money right now. So I just order a little bit less sizing. I hope you don't mind, but if you don't fit in any of those sizes, write to me, Netsy, and I will note that in the future so I can buy that size specifically. I will print now. I will put you in in uh, in the background, <laughs> I guess, and I will put some music. This is like a microphone, but behind it, this is like a frame. So when I will take this microphone out, I will just use use the frame. I'm going to use the hangers and like a stand and put all the t-shirts up here, so they could properly dry up. And yeah, so I just need to clean out the space a little bit 
And this is my computer and this is me. Hello. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this is the end of the video. I want to say thank you so much to everyone who watched till the end or even like some parts or rewatch something. I really appreciate you. I could ask you an advice. If you have hay fever, how do you deal with it? And for now I am using honey, which is actually collected from the bees that live in this area. So this is like a owner's bees. Um, honey so I'm eating it I'm also taking pills so and I am already I bought like um, like a nose um, drops for hay fever they are in the way so that is like that that's how I will deal with it but if you have hay fever let me know how do you deal with it and I feel you it's painful and also I guess thank you Again, for everyone who ordered from my store, it means a lot to me. I'm so happy my store is growing. Also, thank you so much to all of my lovely Patreons who are supporting me throughout this month. Um, have a good day, evening, morning, wherever you are. And I will see you next week. I'm going to try to do good schedule for my YouTube. It's still in the process because I was a little bit behind, but yeah. I'm working on it. I'm really working on it. And yeah, okay. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 <laughs> um, hello. Uh, I am editing the last video. And this is, I don't know, I just had to have this moment. Because <laughs> I am editing video about me editing a video. Okay, uh, hello. Uh, I am editing this video, which you are watching right now. 
And I just wanted to say a few more things. Uh, this is Monday and um, I, in between the last video clips of one color, I already printed the second one and I failed. Uh, I have so many misprints. I think I will re-expose the screens again, have two separate frames and use the printing press rather than hinge gloves because it didn't work. I have perfect paper prints which are made with these hinge gloves and the alignment is like on point. So these are really nice quality and I printed them on nice paper as well. So I will actually sell these ones on Etsy store as well. But um, the t-shirts, uh, the alignment is completely off and uh, yeah, I will put misprints today. Uh, so when the video is up, hopefully the misprint, misprints are added to my Etsy store. And if you don't mind alignment, um, you can buy them with cheaper price because uh, I didn't do it perfectly. Mm -hmm.